Welcome guys, this is KOK Party Favors. I'm bringing to you all of the beautiful baskets that I've made for Mother's Day so far. I still have just a few more left. My goal was 50 and uh, I'm right at that mark right now. So um, these are, and what I've done with my baskets, um, I have put at the top what's in the basket because a lot of times they look through and something may be hiding behind something else or whatever. So I make it kind of easy for them to know what's in the basket. Also, those baskets that have nightgowns, robes, and pajamas, I have a picture on the back side of this pricing um, card. And so they'll be able to see exactly what's in the the robe that's in the back they'll be able to see what that looks like i also put the sizes of my robes and pajamas and house shoes i put that on there as well that just kind of helps them out while they're shopping okay and then it keeps that'll keep me from having to stop what i'm doing and say um that's a large or looking at a list somewhere else everything is going to be where they can see it okay let's see this one for example okay this is the burgundy robe Okay, this is the burgundy robe, so they can get to see what's inside the baskets. I have a lot, I did a lot of work, and I did it early so that I wouldn't be swamped or in a rush trying to get things done. Oh, that's the pretty little bear back there. He's so cute. Okay, there's some back there. And I really enjoyed making these guys. This is my first um, Mother's Day making these baskets. And I really, really enjoyed myself. It's a lot of fun. I invested a little bit more money um, than I had planned on it. But when I started seeing all these deals, I just couldn't pass it up. I had to just go ahead and bite the bullet. Okay. And I got this from Yummy Teas with these tables. And... Um, so what I did was I'm using the, the tabletops and then under the tables, I am using that storage so that I won't be taking up a whole lot of space with my baskets here, the little smaller little boxes for people that may not have, you know, that kind of money to spend on the larger baskets. Okay, and these big ones here, these belong to my family members. I uh, made the mistake of telling all of them that I was going to give them a basket. And when it came time to make them, I was like, oh my God, what did I promise? Because I had to make seven. So there's seven here that um, I'm giving to family members. This big one, this big one. Has a pretty bear in there. He's so pretty. He's purple, pink, white. Purple, pink, and white. And this one, this big one is my mom's. Okay, guys. And see, this is the one I made yesterday uh, on my video. I put that video on my channel. And this one is pretty. This is the one with the Betsy Johnson um, little bath collection in. Okay. And this one with that beautiful mustard color crossbody purse. That one's real pretty too. All right, guys. Well, I'm just about finished. I'm waiting on a few more supplies to come in. And once they come in, I'll get them done, and I'll be ready and waiting for Mother's Day. The only thing I need to get, I have my table covers. I have uh, uh, banners to say Mother's Day. And um, I think I'm going to blow up some balloons and just have it, you know, really nice so they'll know, you know, come get the Mother's Day basket. So... I'm uh, working on that, how my setup is going to be. And because I'm a party planner, I already have, you know, all the tables and tablecloths and 
Uh, I'm not going to put up any backdrop stands, but I'm going to make the uh, banners uh, to where you can easily see them. I might just put them on the front of my tables. And, um, but it's going to say Mother's Day. And then I'm going to have a for sale sign. And I'm just about ready, guys. And I hope you other basket makers are out there getting things set up and ready, too. Good luck, guys. Don't work too hard. And I will see you in the next video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe.